Telepathy. Invulnerability. Technomancy. Um, flying? Shapeshifting. Time control. Guys, I need to talk to you today about Chris Evans, chisel chord hero of all Marvel movies. Here's my problem. You know how a few years ago he played the Human Torch in two movies that shall not be named? Well, now he's Captain America. So, the Human Torch is Captain America, and that makes my geek brain hurt. <coughs> because they're either the same person, which would be weird because why would you enhance an enhanced human, or the Human Torch is Captain America's clone, which would be weird because... what? My current theory is that Johnny Storm is Steve Rogers' son, and I could sort of live with that, though it's still unlikely and I'd have to iron out some continuity kinks. But maybe Joss Whedon can help me out there. I have faith in the Joss. But don't get me started on the Ryan Reynolds, Deadpool, Green Lantern conundrum. Before I forget, for those of you who keep asking, yes, I am dating, no, you're not getting any details. So, you think you can out-cheese me? Well, shall I compare thee to a summer stay? Star-crossed lovers. If you ever really loved a woman. Every night in my dreams I see you, I feel you. Paris. Venice. Fireplace. Candlelight. My little pony. Care Bears, ha! King of Kitsch! Hey! Hey! What are you guys doing? We're gonna watch The Fellowship of the Ring. You wanna join us? Sure. Did anyone bring the popcorn? Man, come on. One remote to rule them all. What do you mean you can't come over? Andrew, we haven't seen each other in two weeks. This is worse than a long distance relationship and we live five minutes from each other. I know that you work a lot, but so do I. And I make the time to meet you. Sorry doesn't cut it. I miss you and I want to spend time with you. Okay, nothing I can do about it now. But this weekend is still on, right? Good. See you then. Bye, honey. Yeah, I'm already in the nervous. Oh, can go. Mark's here. Bye. Oh, hi, Mark. Sorry, I couldn't resist. You're tearing me apart, Lisa. <laughs> it wasn't too original, was it? I think you're my favorite customer. Date. My favorite date. Is there a better way to start a date than quoting an emotional masterpiece? I don't think so. You know the game Zelda, right? Of course, I was named after it. Really? That name must have brought you many stupid jokes. Yeah, but I tend to consider myself lucky. After all, my parents could have gone for toadstool. <laughs> so, want to go somewhere else and have dessert? Don't take this the wrong way. You're a nice girl and I think we could be great friends, but it's never going to be more than that. Story of my life.